Hey guys in this video we're gonna be checking out the top 5 best dog hair brush, that are available on the market for their true quality. I made this list based in my personal opinion and hours of research and have listed them based on popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more. If you want to see more information in the updated price you can check out the description below and also make sure subscribe for more reviews. Okay so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5, we have the Hearts Groomer's Best Combo Dog Brush. This is an all-around great everyday brush. It's effective, inexpensive, and versatile. It has two sides. One has stainless steel pins that can help untangle knots and collect loose hair, particularly for dogs with long, curly, or wiry fur, and the other has soft nylon bristles for finishing and for short coats. The bristles help spread your dog's natural oils throughout the coat for shiny, soft hair. We tested the Hearts Groomer's Best Combo Dog Brush on dogs with a variety of coats, including long, fine hair and long, matted hair. The brush performed exceptionally well with both. It worked best on our Border Collie test subject. One tester even noted that it worked well on her dog's thick butt hair. The Hearts brush was less effective for dogs with short hair and also isn't the right tool if you're looking to tame your dog's undercoat. The heads of the pins have rounded tips, so the brush is particularly gentle. Our testers with short-haired dogs didn't collect quite as much fur, but all dogs seem to be less bothered by this brush, particularly the soft bristled side. The brush has a soft rubber handle that makes it comfortable to hold. That's especially important if you have a big dog or one with lots of hair. Like most pin and bristle brushes, it isn't very easy to clean, but it's hardly a deal breaker for the price and versatility. Moving on at number 4, we have the JW Pet Company Grip Soft Slicker Brush Soft Pin Dog Brush. With very thin, closely set wire bristles, a slicker brush is good for general brushing and removing loose fur. Edmonds recommends a slicker for long-haired pets and double-coated shedding dogs like Siberian Huskies, German Shepherds, and Golden Retrievers. However, she advises against using one on a short-haired dog as it can cause brush burn. We like JW Pet's Gripsoft Soft Slicker Brush because it effectively detangles the coat and removes loose hair. It's stiff enough to untangle the coat but still gentle on the skin. With its flexible stainless steel bristles turned 90 degrees away from the skin, it minimizes breaking, making brushing more comfortable for your dog. The 5.5-inch wide bristle area makes it a good fit for small to large size dogs. I tested this brush on a miniature poodle with a long, curly coat and a Labrador retriever with medium-length hair. Even though these dogs have very different coats, the Gripsoft Slicker worked well on both types. Before testing, I also ran each of the slicker brushes along the inside of my forearm to make sure they felt comfortable. The Gripsoft Soft Slicker brush is very gentle on the skin. The brush is also durable, lightweight, and comfortable to hold with non-slip rubber grips on the curved handle. When I was done brushing, I used my fingers to easily lift the hair out of the rounded brush head. Owners of toy breeds will likely find this brush too big. For the smallest of dogs, I recommend checking out the Miller's Forge Slicker Brush. At number 3, we have the Chris Christensen Dog Brush. For dogs with medium to long hair, a pin brush is a good option for removing loose hair and detangling. This type of brush consists of metal pins that are more widely spaced than the bristles of a slicker brush, which helps prevent hair breakage. The pins are also set into a rubber cushion, and a high-quality brush will have pins with rounded ends to prevent scratches on the skin. We chose the Chris Christensen Oval Pin Brush as our top pick. I've used several Chris Christensen brushes and combs over the years because they came highly recommended by my poodle breeder. This brush lived up to the standard I've come to expect from the brand's grooming tools. I tested this brush on a miniature poodle and found it glided through his coat easily and gently detangled without scratching his skin or breaking off any hairs. The high-quality stainless steel pins have rounded and polished tips, and the pins are set into a durable, firm cushion that has an air vent hole for extra flexibility. The wooden body and easy grip handle are constructed from lightweight solid beach, making it comfortable to hold. The brush is available in three different pin lengths, 20mm for short coats, 27mm for medium to long coats, and 35mm for long, thick full coats. At number 2, we have the Furminator Grooming Rake. 
For pets with thick fur, daily use of a grooming rake can prevent mats by loosening hair and tangles. The rotating metal teeth on this rake remove loose hair in dogs with undercoats or thick fur. It helps untangle knots and work out some mats, so it's especially helpful to use before a de-shedding tool. This works particularly well for dogs with really dense fur like huskies. Some people like to use it to help remove burrs that normally you'd have to tackle with scissors. The pins have rounded tips to avoid irritation, and they're set far enough apart that they don't easily drag hair. This doesn't help much for dogs with short coats, but it shines for longer or thicker hair. While you might only use a de-shedding tool weekly, this is an easy rake to use for a few minutes every day to avoid longer grooming sessions later. And finally at number 1, we have the Kong, Zoom Groom, Dog Brush. This cute rubber brush really excels in the bathtub. Wet your pup, shampoo, and massage, using circular motions to dredge up the hair. It massages while you're brushing, so pets don't seem to mind it. It works well with all hair types but can cause tangles if you get too zealous when scrubbing fine, long hair. The brush does get a little slippery in the tub and can be tough to hold on to. The Zoom Groom can be used out of the bath too. Again, don't brush straight, but move in circles to remove loose hair. Then use a bristle brush to wipe away everything you collect. This is one of Cross's favorite grooming tools. She uses it on both double coat and smooth coat dogs to remove loose top coat hair, typically after brushing with a pin brush and then a fine toothed metal comb. Thanks you for watching guys, I hope you liked this video if this video is helpful to you. Please make sure like comment and subscribe, if you have any question related to this product you can leave a comment down below. I will get back to you as soon as possible.